Go up and click on Options and then click on Design Database. Wait for the new window to open. On the left hand side you'll see a whole list of all of your computer's files and folders. Find the folders that contain your embroidery designs. I have all of my designs stored in separate folders. I have one for flowers, one for borders, one for wildlife. Um, I need a good design. Just click on one of the folders in the list and watch all of your designs open up. You can have as many different folders as you like. This is a great way to organize all of your designs. Right click on a design and choose preview. A preview of your design opens up. And close that. Right click on your design again and choose properties. And a properties window opens up and will show you all of the properties of your design. You can browse through all of your folders to find just the right design that you need. Click on it, preview it, check the properties, and just have fun looking at all your fun designs. I have different folders for a lot of my custom work, digitizing projects. I can pre preview the designs. I can open the properties and check on the amount of stitches, the different colors, the size of the design, everything that you'll need to know. Now, how do you open that design in layout and editing? One way is to go up to the top of your design page, database window, just pull it over a little bit, minimize it just a tad bit. There you go. Choose the design that you would like to open. Left click on it, hold down, drag it up, let go in your layout and editing page and it will open up in there. Now you can close your design database page. From here you can edit your design or send it to your machine. Everything that you need to organize, view, check the properties of any of your designs is already built into the software. It's fun to know how to use it.